Hi everybody, Tina here with Loving Life's Little Blessings and I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about Project Life today. Uh, you are looking at one of my albums. Originally I have been wanting to get the We Are Memory Keeper like the faux leather looking albums. I've been trying to figure out what album um, you know color type brand of album that I really wanted to go with um, because I, ha I have several different albums and I've never really found one that I really liked originally I liked the cloth albums but I found because we live in the country and it's it's we live on you know our property is dirty and dusty and like they just get so dirty that and you can't really clean them so then I really wanted like a faux leather album but every single time I've gone to get albums they never have the the teal color that I want so I've been getting really annoyed so about three weeks ago Michaels did 60% off their albums and I was going to get faux leather we are memory keeper keeper teal albums and of course my Michaels didn't have them but what they did have were these Becky Higgins albums and the only thing that I really don't I really don't care for with these albums is sometimes right here will begin to tear when once you've used your album quite a bit and so I've just thought well maybe I'll just figure if that starts to happen maybe I'll figure out how to deal with it so I really love this album it is the it's from the fifth and frolic line and it says remember this remember this the story of us and I like the color of it and then I like the design and the saying so the, I I'm pretty sure this is the album I'm gonna go with so I I have three of these now so I have two for this year and then this is my 2012 album and this is what I wanted to talk to you guys about today uh, last year is the first year that I got into Project Life. So I had heard about it in October, well, like maybe January of 2012, February 2012. So I had decided to go ahead and I was really behind on my 2011 album. So I finished out that year, the end of that year, and then I did my 2012 album. And what I decided is I didn't have a core kit at the time. So what I just thought I would do is just put my own, you know, use my own stash, use my own paper. So I also didn't really uh, have an understanding of Project Life. Um, I didn't really understand how I was going to do it or like what my process was going to be. And because I was a traditional scrapbooker before... I was still taking photos like a traditional scrapbooker so I would take a hundred photos of the same event and then I would try to do a project lifestyle page well so anyways through that process I really learned a lot about project life and a lot about what my style would be and what I wanted to do and so I've never really been happy with my 2000 and 12 album and while I didn't want to go back and redo the whole thing um, there were a couple things that I really wanted and I really wanted it to fit in one album so you can see this is all of 2012 I um, went back I'm gonna have some photos that I took during the process I didn't shoot any footage uh, when I was doing the process but I just got all my project life stuff out I got all my core kits out set it all on the table and then I just did a little bit of fixing of this album and I wanted to share it with you guys. Um, I took some uh, pages out and some photos out that were really just repetitive and I just really felt like they didn't really need to be in there and then I also changed all my page protectors over to Becky Higgins brand page protectors. I had some 12 by 12 regular page protectors in here that were from, I think they were from I want to say we are memory keepers so I went ahead and tried to get all of the page protectors to all match so everything would just uh, be you know lined up a little bit better so I got this album and I got everything into it and I really wanted 2012 to just fit into one album there really wasn't enough to fit into two albums I don't care how many albums I have per year I usually have two but there really wasn't enough uh, to put into two albums and so I just I just needed to slim it down a little bit so I did get the Clementine core kit halfway 
or probably like three or four months into the year. And originally I was going to try to use that. So I went back and I did some things. I had done some things already. So this is the title page. And then there were also some things in here, like some journaling and stuff that wasn't finished. So I just used the plane. Sorry, that's Andrew.